What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are heading off to go thrifting or as we call it here in Australia, op shopping. I haven't been op shopping in quite some time. It was before this whole pandemic started that I went thrifting so it's been a good couple of months. I, I honestly can't remember. It probably was about February the last time I went. Actually down at one of my local ones today we are going to a Salvation Army and I have been to this one in some time. I normally don't like to go to this one because they don't really like to organize their stuff so hopefully it is somewhat better today and they've got on top of organization with their clothes items. But here we go to the first salvos. I haven't had much luck at this one so fingers crossed today is a little bit different and I have luck. I really hope so. What can I say any more than desire? More than just a pretty face. So you... one thing I don't like about this one is that they don't put the clothes where they should be. They're just like scattered everywhere. So I'm having a really hard time just looking for stuff because there's like a size medium and then there's a size extra small next to it and then there's a size like triple XL. It's just really hard to find anything that I want to get. So I did just over here that they've got so many clothes out the back that they can't take any more donations which is insane but I'm, I'm just going to continue to look I've got three items down here I feel like I'm not doing a great job but I've got three items down here I didn't really have much luck today there was only two items that I got I was kind of disappointed with the whole experience that I had today there was no organization whatsoever with the store just like everything is everywhere so like there's a size 16 next to a size 10 and then a size 12 next to that size 10 it's just all confusing nothing's in their right place and they just don't really care because every single time I go there it's exactly the same so that is why I often don't go there so today today is day two of op shopping I've come very early today I've just dropped off Frederick at school and I'm waiting for them to open up their doors they should actually be open already they're like five minutes late like come on just open up your doors so I can go op shopping but I've decided to come to a Vinnie's I've actually never been been to this one before so I don't know how they are like inside I drive past it quite a bit when I go to another op shop that's down the road I normally go down to Salvation Army that's down the road which is my favorite one but I've decided to pop in to see what the Vinnie's is like here um, and I'm hoping I can find some goodies if not I will go down to my good one the Salvation Army down the road but I wanted to give this one a go today so I'm going to head off <laughs> It is like 10 past 9 and they were open at 9 o'clock. It says they're going to be open at 9 o'clock. I can see people inside, but they're just not opening up. So I'm going to go down to my Salvation Army and I'm just going to go there first and then come here after because I cannot wait. My Salvation Army <laughs> store is open. I'm just going to stay here. And then I'll go back to Vinny's a little bit later. But of course, it started raining now. So this is going to be a joy trying to get Theodore out of the car. But we're going to do it. We're going to just grab all my stuff. Like my purse. We need this if we're going up shopping. And uh, let's go. I'm really excited. I said I wasn't going to do this. But I'm going straight to the men's shirt. So I just can't help myself. I want to find a nice, cool graphic tee. I feel like it's been like so long and I just need to find, I just need to find one. So far, I'm not having any luck. I haven't found anything. Not one piece. <laughs> Much luck at my Salvation Army today. So 
we're going to go head to Venice just to see what they've got. I'm just curious to see what they've got. They might have some good stuff in there that um, my Salvation Army didn't have today. I've been watching lately, moving left to right. Got me going crazy, kind of Disney on lights. And I don't really do dancing, but baby, I don't care. Cause there's something about you, and I want. Well, we're done op shopping. I don't think I'm having any luck today with just grabbing anything. I'm a bit bummed there were so many goodies there. Like, I've never been to this Vinnie's before, like I said, and there were so many goodies. But just none of them look good on me. And I was so thrilled to find like a nice pair of jeans. But um, they decided, no, they weren't gonna button up. So I couldn't grab them, but they were gonna look so cute if they could fit me. But anyway, I'm gonna give up for op shopping today. I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna show you what I've picked up over the last couple of days. So we've just got home from op shopping and I have a bag of goodies that I wanna go through and show you what I've picked up through the last two days of op shopping. So there's not that many items, but I'm still very happy with everything that I got and I think you guys are going to love all the pieces. So yesterday when I went to the Salvation Army, I ended up picking up only two items. The first piece was just this white top. I really liked it because of the material it's kind of like a cheesecloth material so it would be really perfect for summer over swimsuit or even just a really cute top so I had the idea of actually tying it up at the front because it is a longer top and I'm not a fan of longer tops to be honest unless I tuck them in like this then I don't really like to wear tops that just like hang I either tuck them in or I tie them so I thought this top would be perfect because it's long enough that I could tie it up at the front and I think it would just look really cute, especially because it is that cheesecloth material. So next item I got is a grandpa cardigan. I am someone who loves anything grandpa-ish. Just like, if there's a sweater or a cardigan that just makes me think of my own granddad, I am going to pick it up. But anyway, I ended up picking this cardigan up. It is the cutest cardigan ever. I just saw it and I was like, this is something my granddad would wear and it's also something my dad would wear. Um, so maybe that's why I decided I wanted it because it's both of them and I adore both of my granddad and my dad. So yeah, I had to get it. I just had to get it. It was the cutest little cardigan ever and I might never wear this, but I just had to purchase it. I couldn't just let someone else get it and me not have a chance of wearing it. It's just this, so it is just a striped cardigan. It is more of a muted blue, gray kind of toned. I really like it. I just love this cardigan so much. I did not try it on in the store, so I have no idea if it's itchy or anything. Fingers crossed it is not, and I have just not wasted $12 of my money because yes, this was $12. I didn't realize it was that expensive until I got up to the counter and he's like, that's $12 for that one. I'm like, what? It has an orange tag on it. It should not be $12, but apparently it was. Other than those two items, I actually only picked two more items up. I just wasn't having great luck. While op shopping this time, I looked through the kids' clothes, I looked through the men's clothes, I looked through the homeware, everywhere. And I just couldn't find anything that I wanted to grab. But I did grab two other pieces from the Salvation Army that I went to today. So I normally don't purchase anything from this section, but I was just browsing through the shoes and I came across these shoes. And I just came, I just, I just... I just had to get them. I don't know why I had to, but I don't have any black heels in my collection. I have very minimal heels in my wardrobe because, well, I just don't wear them. So I wanted to start going out a little bit more, especially with Jason on dates. And I want to start like dressing up a little bit more than just, you know, the casual 
casual clothes that I normally wear every single time we go out for dinner. So yeah, I ended up getting these black heels. I am going to sanitize them, obviously, with all the other things that I purchased before wearing them. But I'm really happy that I got them. And they're only... They were only $8. The last thing I grabbed was not something that I had in mind to purchase for myself, but I saw it and I was just like, this would be a cute little date dress. So I ended up getting it and I found this beautiful like bodycon slip dress and it's so stunning. I love the color because it is that muted color that I love, but also it has this like ruched detailing at the front which is kind of forgiving for someone like me who has a little bit of a mum pouch so I feel like I'm gonna feel very comfortable in this dress but it's not too dressy that I won't feel like overdone this actually doesn't have a size tag on it it does say it's from misguided so I know it's a good quality dress but I don't know what size it is but it is very stretchy, so I'm sure this will be able to fit on my body. So yeah, I thought this dress would go perfect with those black heels that I got today. So I ended up getting this, and this was actually quite expensive. It was $13, but you know what? For a misguided dress, I am not sad that I paid $13 for it. But that is everything that I got over the last two days op shopping. I know it wasn't that much. But the pieces that I got, I will all use. So I am very happy that I went off shopping. It, like I said, it's been a very long time since I've been. And it, it made me very happy going off shopping over the last two days. So I hope you all enjoyed seeing me shop and seeing what I picked up while I was shopping, obviously. But I hope you all enjoyed seeing what I've picked up over the last couple of days and but I hope you all enjoyed seeing what I got over the last couple of days and coming shopping with me. If you want to see more thrift with me, let me know because I am happy to do them. Um, but I will see you all in a couple of days. Bye.